Hi, I'm Mike. I'm Scott. And I'm Mark. We are your Screen Machine product support team, and here's another quick tip. Hello. Today we will be going over how your remote Grizzly uh, function operates on your 612T Trommel. So this is a pretty common option on, on our trommels here, is the remote Grizzly uh, up there on top of our uh, feed hopper there. You'll notice a couple other differences. If you get that uh, Grizzly, you'll also get a big hefty guard right here, uh, a little bigger than the standard guard that goes on there to make sure that when that Grizzly dumps off, the material doesn't damage anything in there, or any, any functions, any components, it hits that nice heavy guard and slides right off onto the ground uh, if it goes in that area. So. What, what we're going to do is your remote Grizzly is only actuated by the remote right here. You can't actuate it on the panel or anything like that. You need the remote to do it. There's a button here that says Grizzly. So uh, we've already got our machine turned on. It's at low idle. Uh, make sure when you when you actuate this Grizzly, no personnel, equipment, anything like that are in the, in the danger zone here. That's why I'm standing well away over here. So uh, what it's going to do is it's going to actuate, it's going to go up till it hits a certain preset pressure from the factory, and it's going to stay up there for a second or two, and then it's going to go back down and hit, hit another preset uh, pressure from the factory that will then shut the Grizzly function off. So you don't have to hold this button or anything like that. All you do is press it once, it goes up, comes down, goes through its whole operation. So we're going to go ahead, hit the Grizzly. You can see now it's picking up. It's going to go all the, it's going a little slower since it, the engine's at low speed. It, it goes a little faster when you're at actually at a run speed. So it's going to come all the way uh, over center there to dump that material off of there. It's going to go up all the way vertical. All right, now that it's all the way vertical, it's going to dump that material off. You can see it hit that pressure setting. Now it's going back down. It's going to go all the way back down. Then we'll hear another click. That means it, it's hit that other preset pressure setting and it'll actually shut off. So give it a second, there we go, I just heard it again. Now we know that it's went through its complete cycle.